Hey guys, welcome back to the vlog. I hope everyone is doing fabulous today. Big up, big up, big up. Today is going to be a grocery shopping vlog and haul, plus a little cooking, a little chefings in the mix. So that's what we're about to do today. This is my first grocery shopping trip since the new year start. So I am trying to incorporate some things in my meals and eliminate some things out of my meals um fruit vegetables frozen fruits and vegetables too because i am doing more smoothies incorporating more smoothies and juicing in my diet and i also have peas and beans like chickpeas like me i love chickpeas like i love a nice curried chickpeas so i have those laundry stuff anyway that's what we're about to do so remember like up the video share up the video and if you're not already subscribed guys go ahead hit the subscribe button so you're notified every time there's a new video i don't know if you're like me but before i go grocery shopping even though i make a list i like to come in the kitchen open the fridge the cupboards look to see if there's anything i need so i can just pick it up and done so guys before we go grocery shopping there is this little hack that i saw on instagram that i want to share with you guys today i don't know if everybody know about it but nobody never tell me so I was not aware, but if you're like me, oh, first of all, I'm wearing my bodysuit, one of them from Zara. It feels really good. It's very stretchy. It cut kind of deep right here, so you can't really wear your bra straps. I guess you can kind of crisscross it to the back, but I just take off the bra straps. Anyway, so once you have, so I have three chains on. I guess this only works with two. So what you do, instead of latching each chain, as we would usually do, what you do, you alternate the latches, right? So this one, I latched it on this one. So what that allows you to do is no matter how you move up and down, no matter how you hackle yourself throughout the day, they will not get intertwined and tangled at all. So, and the good thing about it, guys, you can even, you can extend it because look, I just kind of draw this one up. It gets it shorter or you can definitely get it as long as you want. See, as long or as short as you want. So, for example, you want to lay uh, two chains and both of them are the same, about the same length, guys. Alternate the latches and just like that extend it like that may i tell you life changing life changing all right guys so that's my little hack my little tip for the day anytime i see these i'll be definitely sharing them with you guys especially if they work especially because this life changing life changing so remember go and do the do like up the video share up the video if you're not already subscribed guys go ahead hit the subscribe button remember if you like the channel you you're entertained by the content you like what i am posting go ahead and share the content share with your family your friends your cousin your auntie your brother i don't know anybody the man around the road woman around the street share up the video them guys get everybody involved and yeah just go and do the do let's go grocery shopping <music> shopping and so far have peel broccoli celery no make it some shredded carrot this I feel like salad you take this Publix brand this is a good way you can save money too when grocery shopping you can buy the store the store brand products is the same thing guys you eat mushroom like me recently started add it to like my salad well not add it order it when ordering the salad and then uh, i think we eat it one time at cheesecake factory so i don't know probably if we'll learn how it cook i think it hard for cook but 
I don't know. I mean, to me, it really have no taste, but it, I think it soaks up flavor really well. And I know vegans use it as like a meat substitute because it have like a meaty texture to it. But probably not gonna bite today. We take some asparagus. I like green beans and I like asparagus. And then usually, I don't know if this right or wrong, but I like to check if them like how good they are. By kind of breaking it just to make sure I kind of get a good batch. So I'm not really vlogging, vlogging because the music in here right now, me in the detergent aisle. Just get that out of the way before I go to like the meats and the frozen stuff. Um, like the island breeze one, this is where we usually use. But I'm going to live a little and have some fun <laughs> and try something new. So I'm going to try the blissful of breeze and so I'm like this one also need a pine saw alright while I'm at it I'm going to get another one of my plugins and guys we just smell this one the linen and sky it smells really good I'll try the bora 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 and I really do it I'll try that I'm going to try this one and here you guys ever try the just egg this other like the vegan version of egg four dollar seventy nine cent mercy bin seeds and people say tastes good and tastes just like egg but i don't know so if any of you ever try it and like it probably get it at next time but just gonna get some regular regular eggs right now definitely like both of the eggs when I buy them just to make sure everything looks alright almond milk almond breeze one it's so weird this tea is 100% different from the small ones this it don't have no taste the big one have no taste but the smaller ones taste good oh whenever you try the peach mango Try this first the vanilla, Ooh, dark chocolate coconut. They try all three of these. Usually, all these just stick to the plain old vanilla, but let's live a little. So, I'm basically finished picking up now everything off my list. One thing, minus the near lettuce, minus the lettuce. Um, what else? Oh, we need to go to Jamaican supermarket for like fish but my doubt me I'm gonna make it today so I'm just gonna head on home now guys and then we'll do a grocery haul so you can see everything that I got okay guys so I'm back home never really got that much stuff but i took my good old time enjoyed my little shopping trip my little grocery shopping trip and really and truly most things that i realized that i did pick up are like greens and frozen fruits for my smoothies so let me just get right into the haul and show you what i got so for the laundry i got the downy fabric softener the gain laundry detergent i picked up another one of these fabrice plugins and this is just in the linen and sky it smells really good i would say the last about i would say about two months yeah because the one that i bought probably why in november it's still going strong so they say it lasts what well, i think they say 100 days of freshness that's three months they last about i would say two months and a few days not a hundred days and i got the gain dryer sheets just in the original scent so oh and pine salt all right so next i got some shrimp guys i got the raw ones i like to buy my shrimp uncooked raw so that i can cook it because sometimes when you buy the cooked one they are just very rubbery already so i got some large shrimp and then I got some chicken breast, three pieces, and I'm going to be cooking chicken breast today. Right now, honestly, I am mostly eating chicken and fish. 
I get carrot, shredded carrot for salads. Um, green apples. Green apples are for smoothies as well. And strawberries. I already have blueberries, so just get strawberries. I got some lemon for lemon. I like to do lemon water in the morning, and I like to do lemon on like my fish, things like that. And any other little thing, you can squeeze the lemon and it give it a nice flavor. I got three tomatoes, cooking tomatoes. I'm not a fan of tomato ever since I came to America. I'm not sure why, they just don't taste good to me. So even in salads, I no longer do tomatoes. Um, then I got broccoli. I really like broccoli. Sometimes it can be very filling. I like chicken and broccoli, fish and broccoli. Then I got some green beans. Really like green beans as well. And then kale. So kale, kale is for my smoothies and Spinach. Spinach is multifunctional. I cook them, I put them in smoothies, salads. So I got spinach. Then I got avocado. You know, I'm an avocado toast type of girl. And I also like to put it in my smoothie because it makes your green smoothie very, very creamy. If you don't want to put like banana, drop two frozen pineapple and avocado, good to go. My green tea. For the beans, I got chickpeas and I got some black bean. I already have kidney beans. And guys, I'm trying to stay away from the can, the can stuff. I usually buy them canned, but with the extra sodium. Just trying to stay away from that right now. Then I didn't buy any bread because, you know, I keep that frozen. But I did get the cinnamon swirl bread. We like to do this. It's very little guilty pleasure. So I got some coconut water. This is also for my smoothies as well. Uh, sometimes you're not really into the milk. So I'm going to get my almond milk, of course, the unsweetened one. But the coconut water sometimes tastes really good in your, in your smoothie. So I got two of these. Then I got some extra virgin olive oil. I used to use it one time and then I kind of stopped. It does have a taste and when you just start using this you might not be used to the taste but it's all right and then i got the eggs i showed you that so some eggs i like boiled eggs and sometimes eggs with the avocado toast some unsalted butter also my dairy free yogurt i'm excited to try this mango peach one. i never tried this one before regular vanilla and chocolate and the soy sauce so what i'm cooking today i'm going to need a little bit of soy sauce i was trying to get the low sodium one but i didn't see it and then kind of finally over here now my frozen fruit you know guys i really i ended up with three pineapple frozen pineapple really and truly i only did one two frozen pineapple and one frozen mango but through the mango and the pineapple yellow alike i ended up with three but that's all right because these i snack on them but one thing i will tell you do not eat too much don't snack on too much because they say pineapple you eat pineapple and it eats your back <laughs> why does that when you eat too much you start to feel that burn so and that is why they say it's good for weight loss because it's like whatever is in it yeah i don't know but they say it's really good for weight loss so that these i am incorporating more smoothies into my diet and then i got triple berries this is blueberry blackberry raspberry and i got just the blueberries because sometimes i just like a nice blueberry smoothie Ooh, with just the blueberry not no other berries just the blueberry because the raspberries they can be very grainy sometimes but the blueberries tend to be very very smooth and guys, that's that's it. That's basically it for my grocery haul. That's all I got. Comment down below and tell me how much you think I spent on all of these. Okay, guys. So if you hear something, listen. That's boo. I'm going to take care of the lawn and the grass. So I spent $206.27 on everything. So that's what everything come to. I didn't get like any potato, banana, ow, things like that. We already have, right? Some kind of fruits. Boo already always get him fruits. Um, so every little thing. Oh, did I show you the oats? I don't remember. But don't remember say oats. But yeah, I'm going to get my quick oats. You know me as an oats lover. 
so I got my oats. So right now, guys, at the grocery hall, oh yeah, I'm kind of hungry. So I am going to do some cooking. I'm going to do. I was going to do the asparagus, but I'm going to do the green beans. I'm going to do the green beans, a lem, mm, the chicken breast, but I'm going to do garlic and honey. So honey, garlic, chicken breast, and then some mashed potatoes. So that's what we are about to cook right now. Okay guys, so that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Remember, do did do, do, like up the video, share up the video guys, and hit that subscribe button. I'm about to enjoy my meal, and yeah, I love you guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.